Finally, a really good movie that I can recommend. It feels like it's been a while. Hey everyone, it's Jason from EskimoTV.net, and today I will be reviewing Freaks, which is directed by Zach Lepofsky and Adam Stein. It was released in select theaters this past weekend. Seek this movie out. If you need to drive a little further to see it, go check it out. It's the most thrilling movie of 2019 I've seen this year. I've seen it twice. Freaks is a compelling sci-fi that follows seven-year-old Chloe, who is played stunningly by Lexi Kolker. This little girl can act and carries most of the film. Freaks reminded me a little bit of 2015's Room. This young girl is stuck in a dilapidated house. Her father is played by Emil Hirsch, who warns her that she cannot leave this house or she will die. Hirsch's performance is intense and both her and Kolker will easily hold your attention. What I love about this movie is that it successfully gets you to ask question after question as the movie progresses. You naturally wonder within the first 10 minutes, is this dad crazy? Is he hiding something? Or maybe danger really does exist, and if so, what is it? How did it get there? Dad tells Chloe that if she's ever discovered, she has to take on a different identity, and Chloe has all of this memorized. She knows her fake address, fake parents, and it's all extremely suspenseful. Some movies will have a premise, but then it becomes so convoluted to where there's no way to guess what could actually happen because everything feels so forced and just convoluted. Freaks is grounded in reality because given these sci-fi circumstances that you learn about, it feels like realistic choices that would be made by a group of characters. Freaks gets us invested in the few characters it strategically focuses on and introduces us to its concepts in an engaging, suspenseful, and thrilling way. The pacing moves along quickly as there's lots of back-to-back -back scenes that are really interesting. Bruce Dern plays an ice cream truck driver who entices Chloe into his truck. We as the audience have the thought, is this old man creepy and going to hurt Chloe? The movie does a great job at getting us to guess what might happen and it subverts those expectations in a very satisfying way. There's some sequences that feel dreamlike involving Chloe and her neighbor and Chloe and her mom. These scenes felt a little confusing at first, but on a second viewing, it made a whole lot more sense. Perhaps one scene where the characters talk about why this phenomenon occurs would have solidified to audiences what was happening in these moments that initially felt a little bit confusing and hard to follow. Nonetheless, it's one of my favorite movies this year, and the most thrilling movie I've watched this year. I'm gonna give Freaks an A. Let me know what you think about Freaks or if you're going to be checking this movie out. And if you enjoyed this review, you can find more at EskimoTV.net. Be sure to like this video, share it with your friends, subscribe, and hit the bell button so you get notifications on the latest Icy and Chili Eskimo TV reviews.